Joey's show, not mine. <laughs> Welcome back to Living 808. I am finishing up the hour burger because this is our show. It's, it's your show. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm here with executive chef Paul. He's also the founder of Wall Burgers. Bro, I'm gonna start off by saying this is the worst day for me to be on a diet because everything looks so good here. What why, are you, at? why are you on a diet? You look like you're in very good shape. You, <laughs> like you, you, you work out, so you, you gotta. You gotta feed the machine. I appreciate you. Yep. Okay, well speaking of feeding the machine, I'm gonna eat this, but if you don't yep. mind telling everybody out there what we got in front of us over here. So we have we have our tot flight, which mm -hmm. is uh, uh, bacon and, um, and cheese, and then we have truffle parmesan, and then we have barbecue with roasted corn and pulled chicken, which wow. is fantastic. Over here we have our loco moco, which is, you know, if yep. you're in Hawaii, you have to do it. Yep. So it's got the teriyaki glaze. It's got that beautiful burger. It's got sautéed mushrooms, the gravy, over uh, sunny side egg, and some fresh scallions. A barbecue bacon burger, which I is always yep, prepared. yep. And then um, we have our Jen's chicken salad, fried pickles, uh, fries, and our classic uh, onion, uh, very thin shredded onion onion rings. I love that. So. You know, I want to go back to this right here. This is your local mogul wall burger here. Yep. You can only find this at the Hawaii store location. Yep. Um, I want to know a little bit more about your creative process when it's in the kitchen. Um, are some of these recipes, you know, family favorites? Um, what's going on? What's in your mind? Some of the things are family favorites. Some of the things are going to be inspiration because you never know where that inspirational piece is going to come from. Right. And so it's always important for us to kind of look at things and, and kind of have different feels for it. And so you never know where that inspiration is going to come from, right? You know, as you're sitting there and you're tasting something, you say, oh, my God, this would be really good with yeah. X. This would be really good with Y. Yeah. And so there's lots of other things. And then there's also collaboration with different, you know, different people in the kitchen. Because, right. like I said, you never know where that next real yeah. fun thing is going to come from. Well, speaking of collaborations, let's talk about, um, you know, your brothers. Yep. Um, if you look around, you guys, you'll, you'll notice little nods to all of the movies that Mark Wahlberg is inside. I see on the top of there, we see yep. Renaissance Man, we yep. see Beyond the Night. What is it like working with your brothers um, in a family business? I mean, like, is it hard? Is it difficult? Is it easy? Is it fun? It's, it's, it's a little bit of everything. You know, you um, kind of look at things, and when you talk to people, it's, it's, it's amazing because they bring their perspective to right. what it is that we do. Right. And, and, and so their opinions are fantastic. They're very, very insightful. But it's also fun because you're still brothers. Yeah. You're still family. Right. So that, that, you know, that kidding, that jiving that goes along with it, you know, there's, you know, nothing sacred. Yeah. And, and so everybody works, but the, everybody just does such a great job working together. So we just love it. I love that. Okay. Now I know we're talking about the food. We're talking about everything in front of us. I want to know, what is chef's favorite thing to eat here? And I'm sorry, that's almost like me asking you, who's your favorite child? No, I, <laughs> I, I, for me, the, my favorite is the Owl Burger because oh, okay. it's just that really great classic, classic American burger. Um, but I, you know, you, can't, you love everything because there's all of, you know, it depends on your mood. Um, right. But like I said, you know, having that Owl Burger is to me like the best example of, of, of what it is we try to do. Right on, I love that. The, let's talk about what's coming up in terms of Wall Burgers. What can all of your fans expect at Wall Burgers? Um, we, well, we're always trying to, you know, come up with new, you know, new and exciting different dishes. So right. that's always that's always a plus. We're going to be working over at Nextcom. That's going to be opening up um, in June. Okay. So we're very excited by, about that. And really, just trying to, you know, we just want to keep pushing forward. Right on, bro. Just want to keep pushing forward and do the best we can and make people happy. I appreciate you. Well, thank you so much for making me happy. My coach right now, he's probably watching. He's probably thinking, why did you just eat that burger? But it's okay, coach. I mean, it's worth it. Absolutely, <laughs> brother. Thank you so much. Thank you. I, really I appreciate, appreciate it. you. Thank you, you guys, we're going to have more information on KH12.com. If you're not doing anything today, like I said earlier, make your way over to Wahlburgers and you can have a feast. And you got to try out our burger here at Wahlburgers. Kelly, I'm going to send it back to you and I'll be over in just a second. Oh, you better be. And bring doing. that because you know who's not on a diet? This girl. And I will eat every single thing on that table. That looks good. And it's so cool to see. You know, you see these uh, famous people in front of brands, but I didn't realize he was the executive chef too. So the fact that he's actually in the kitchen making the calls, that's really, really neat. I can't wait to try.